we can manipulate systems of linear equations without changing their solution set. There are three standard things we can do to a system that do not change the solution sets. Let's look at each of them in turn. First of all, it doesn't matter what order the equations are written in, so you can swap two equations. So for example, if you took this system and you swapped these equations to get to this new system, This system and this system have the same solution sets. Two, we can multiply an equation by a non-zero constant in the sense that doing that does not change the solution set of the system. So if we're once again working with this system, and we decide we don't like this two, we decide that we'd rather have a one here, then leaving the first equation alone, we can take the second equation and multiply both sides by one half minus one half y equals three halves. This system and this system have the same solution set because because obviously this equation and this equation have the same solution set. We haven't changed the first equation. And for the second equation, it's just high school algebra. You can take an equation and multiply both sides by the same number, and you don't change the solutions to the equation. The third thing that we can do to a system that will not change its solution set is a little more complicated. We can multiply an equation by a constant and then add that result to a different equation. Let's keep with this same example. And let's use this rule to rewrite the second equation. So the first equation remains the same. What this rule now is saying is that you can take the first equation and multiply it by a constant. 
that say a negative two. Why I chose negative two specifically, we'll see in section 1.2. But if this equality is true, then this equality is true. And now we're going to take this and we are going to add it to the second equation. Our x's go away and negative 2y plus negative y, negative 3y, equals negative 11. And note it as part of this, we multiplied the first equation by negative two. However, we're not changing the first equation. Multiplying the first equation by negative two was a step on the way to changing the second equation. This system and this system have the same solution sets.